calm, aren't they? Moments like these. The moments before the end. If you've hurt my son, nothing will protect you. No man, no beast, no god. He's safe with me, Cassandra. Happy, healthy. And I promise you, he always will be. Think about where we're going, Amorgis. This path can only end in one place, unless you tell me where to find my son. I'm sorry, Cassandra. I can't do that. I once swore to the people I loved I would crush the Order. Believe me, I will keep that promise. You think you can destroy us? <laughs> The Order's plan goes well beyond you, Cassandra. What? Ever the hero, thinking this is all about you. This isn't about any one of us. It's about that most precious of things, peace. This war between Athens and Sparta threatens to incinerate more than just the Greek world. The carnage and butchery have spread to Persia and beyond. The Order has the power to save the world. And so we will. My agents are rooted deeply in every aspect of Greek life. We have seeped into your establishments, your temples, your homes. We are winning the hearts of your people. Through the Order's influence and Persia's wealth, Sparta will end this war. A new chapter in history will be written. By us. We have planted a seed in the fertile soil that is the Greek people. And now, peace will grow. Only one threat to that peace remains. You. What you think? I... I don't want a war. I want my son. You don't want a war? You brought one to my door. You're a tainted one. The strongest, most dangerous force the Order has ever seen. You are fire. Only you stand in the way of the Order's purpose. You've forgotten our promise, old friend. Artabanus, I wondered when you'd make your dramatic entrance. Think of the innocent lives that were lost, Amorgus. You claim to want peace, but what good is peace when it's enforced by tyranny? I fought for the greater good, for our children, for their futures. I saved your grandson, and I saved Artaxerxes that night. Do you remember? I saved him from you. Tell us where Elpidios is. I'm sorry. As long as I breathe, I will never endanger the child by letting her raise him. Do you remember the truth I whispered in the ear? 
safer hands than yours, Gallus. <laughs> The sun rises, but she also sets. My time is over, old friend. We were protectors of Morgus. We were champions of Persia. Of the people. I still am our Hvanus. I only wanted to keep our home safe. The world safe. The child, Amorgus. Please. He's on a small island, just off the coast of Messenia. Perfect spot for fishing. The Order will never give up, Cassandra. You and your boy will always be hunted. And he will always have me to protect him. The Order aren't just a group of people. They're an idea. An idea cannot be beaten. An idea cannot be destroyed. Not by blades, but through knowledge, through wisdom, through ideas of our own. Nothing is absolute, Amorgus. You taught me that a long time ago. There will always be tyrants. And there will always be you, my brother, to stop them. Go in peace, old friend.
Amorgis was true to his word, Elbidios will be there. I meant to be out this far. Hold on. Just hold on. over my son every day every night a morgis made sure of it thank you you know he has a real spartan appetite <laughs> tell me about it Mother's got so many stories to tell you. <laughs> oh. And you've got some stories for Mother, too, I see. Who are you? I am Darius. Son of the Persian king, Artaxerxes. Artaxerxes. Do you know my father? We've met, but it's been a while. He's a good king and a great father. Persia knows peace. She prospers. I miss him. Keep Persia safe. That is his legacy. Time. Just a moment longer. It has to be now. was right. I am fire. I'll use that. A beacon to the Order. If they want to come after my bloodline, they'll know exactly where to find me. But they'll never find... And... What will you do, Darius? The Order was 
was created for a purpose. If I can understand our enemy, I can outmaneuver them. I will protect the boy, Cassandra. Be a guardian to Epidios and to all those who share his blood. When the day comes, when he asks of his matter, <sighs> what should I tell him? Tell him he had a mother and father who lived incredible lives, who saw incredible things, and none of it was as incredible as him. His smile, his love, the sight of him asleep in my arms. The day come where he feels unloved or alone, you tell him there is no such day, because he will always be loved. You hear me? You will always be loved. You'll fight, and you'll fall. There will be times when you'll think you can't rise again. You'll want to stay down. But you will get up and be this. Because you're strong. Because our bloodline is strong. And because we always get up. You'll ask why. And while you'll never know me, know this. You are my son, and I'll always fight for you. You, and those that will come after. <laughs> 